Hi people and welcome to the second episode uh, to how to make the BMW Z4 in Fusion 360 if you have any question or suggestion to model this please uh, leave me a comment I will respond you and don't forget to go to my website to um, to download or if you want to see more tutorials about modding and uh, how to make a v12 engine in uh, fusion 360 you can discover many methods uh, to take over of this software In this episode, I will uh, model this um, this zone. Here, I start the um, sketch in the left uh, left plane or the right plane. Then I I use a spline. Then when you click in this point you have access to uh, to the controller point okay then you have just to to, um, to, to move it use uh, m in your uh, keyboard once you finish modeling uh, or uh, changing the um, this point using the um, the, the controllers then look from the um, from the top or or from the front you have just to, to to use m to move it make sure the 3d uh, 3d sketch is check on in the sketch parameters and you have just to move these points okay I'm using this sketch just like a reference the final uh, sketch I will draw it after select the spline and make it for construction once you finish go to the spline again and start from this point okay you can just return your model in the 3d view so the, the trip here um, if you click you are in the left view fusion um project the point in the left um, in the left plane and that's what uh, I want that I want just to um, to project the point on the, the 3d sketch or in the 3d um, uh, reference. If you can't move this point you have just <coughs> to delete the coincidence constraint then then move it in this position the same thing in the in this uh, area choose the controllers 
and add constraint here we have a neural because I am not select the best uh, point okay as you can see the points are black now just select the point of the controllers and just try to fit it uh, to the first spline once you have this uh, select spline and add this in the 3d view okay then you have just to to use controllers activate it and use controllers as you can see look from the side the same thing use the same controllers like this when all thing is all right choose another spline as i say to you when you look from the right you have your point in the right plane it's not a problem you have just use this arrow and move it like this use controllers you will hear controllers move controllers move controllers move in this tutorial in all of this series of this bmw you will have just uh, to you have just to follow step by step uh, to um, to have the same result as you saw in the first tutorial Once you finish this, I have just add another 3D sketch here. Okay. And use controllers, activate it.
when all thing is all right like this you have just to go to uh, patch and select you can check off the enable chaining and select all of this press ok to validate well done you finish the second episode of the modeling the bmw z4 in fusion 360 thanks in the next episode i hope you will be in in time to see this Thanks for watching. If you like to receive more videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you find this tutorial helpful, please make a thumbs up. Cheers.